Hey guys, Carolina Gamer here. Going to show you how to flash a 79 Hitachi drive using the X360 USB and the CK3CP. As you'll notice, we have our really long and nice power cable connected that comes with the Probe 3. We have our SATA cable connected to the X360. We have the USB connected to the computer. So now, I'm just going to set up the camera so that you can see the drive and what it does, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, now that we're here in Jungle Flasher with the Hitachi, what we're going to do is go ahead and hit Send Mode B. Okay guys, we just hit Send Mode B in Jungle Flasher, so what we're going to do is what the box says, we will eject our drive, put in our 79 Unlock CD, turn the drive off, hit OK on the screen. Okay, now that we got the drive turned off and ejected we'll go ahead and hit OK then we will turn the drive on this right here is normal so don't don't freak out this box will pop up letting you know that there's something on there that's fine just close it hit 79 unlock See, when you hit 79 unlock, the tray will automatically eject for you. Okay, now we're in mode B, 79 is unlocked. Um, we have our options here. What we're going to do is we're going to go to Flash LT Plus. We will go to Flash LT Plus. It's going to tell us flashing stability test report stable. Do you want to continue? We'll hit yes. And there you go. That's it. That's how quick it is to do a 79 Hitachi drive. Um, what was that? A couple, not even a minute to from mode B to flash complete, which it says right here. So, um, yeah, and well, there you go. Uh, just popped up our session, but still, you see it says flash complete really quick. It's easy to do with the X360 USB. Uh, follow me on Twitter, Carolina Gamer. Subscribe to me on YouTube. Um, go check out the forums, Team Executor. Uh, more information on the X360 USB at x360usb.com from Team Executor. And yeah, Carolina Gamer, out.